Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video and today we're actually going to be returning to my custom solar system which I've now actually renamed uh, as a solar system just so it appears at the top of my list here so it's easier to access but yeah we're going to be just um going through some of the objects in here because I actually um need you guys' help with one of these objects here and yeah we're going to be checking out this um custom Uranus as well because that's probably going to be the main focus of this video so yeah, stay tuned for that, I guess. And also, um, yeah, I thought I'd um, switch things up a bit because we've been doing a lot of um, making custom objects recently. So I thought I'd do some a different video um, sort of... Um, how, how do I say it? It's a different sort of video um, idea for change because all we're doing pretty much over the last few weeks is just making objects. So I thought I'd um, flip things over a bit, change things up um, and do one of these. So actually, um, I'm actually planning to return to like the what-if sort of video. So if you guys have got any like what-if scenarios we can do let me know down below because i actually have a ton planned which i'm planning to record at some point so yeah just um stay tuned for that and if you've got any ideas for like what if f f scenarios and just let me know in the comments because that be, should be pretty interesting but first of all we're going to start off with series today and also subscribe if you haven't already just put throw that out there <laughs> so here is series guys now one thing i've always or one issue i've always had with this object is it's Albedo, when you spawn in a new series, so if we just um, go ahead to that, because I actually really need you guys to help with this. I've, I've tried researching it, and I literally couldn't find anything. So if we just um, get a new series in here, so here it is. So, and it also, when I save the simulation, it makes the object smaller, so I actually need to fix that. But here is a normal series that you get. So as you can, oh, excuse me there. As you can see, the albedo is 0, 0.00. So this means the object doesn't reflect any light at all. Is that correct? Like, can you guys help me out with that? Like, does Ceres... Like, this this surely can't be right. Does anyone know the albedo of Ceres? Because I did some... I tried doing the research, and I've just put it as 0.01. Because I, I can't find an answer anywhere. So if anyone knows the albedo of Ceres, please can you um, let me know of that? Because it's really... It's really getting on my nerves how I can't find the answer anywhere. Like, it's really, really annoying. And one thing I need to do, 476 kilometers. Yeah, we need to um, fix that. So... 476. Yeah, for some reason, when you save objects in a simulation, like some of the default objects, they decide they want to get smaller. It happens with Neptune. Neptune actually gets a little bigger when you save it in a simulation, and Pluto also gets smaller. So what I've done is I've had to put full stops in front of them like this to stop the size from getting smaller. For some reason, if you use, like, just the name Ceres or Pluto, the object changes when you save it. But if you put um, some other um, characters in the name, it doesn't do it for some reason. It's very, very strange. So yeah, let's um, actually just go ahead and quickly um, update the solar system as well. So let's just save it and just call it a solar system, like that. And now, that's pretty much all that done. So yeah, now we're going to get onto the good bit. So here is the custom Uranus that was um, shown in last episode. So this is made by Some Dumb Gamer again. And when I asked you guys last video, I did sort of... Oh, whoops, don't want to play that. So yeah, I asked you guys um, in the video... What Uranus do you think I should have, or like we should use from now on? And it was between these two Uranuses here. So there was my custom auto-generated Uranus, which I got from a custom object spawn. And then here was the custom Uranus that some dumb gamer made in the game files by modding like the game. And every single one of you said you wanted this custom Uranus he made. So yeah, let's get rid of that. And I gotta say, I can't agree with you more. This is perfect. This is the best custom like planet in our solar system now like this is really cool like honestly planet nine i think you've been beaten because yeah this is this is a custom spawn like a random spawn and this is probably the best random spawn i've ever got but although this is a modded object i think this just sort of beats planet nine sadly but you guys can tell me what you think do you think planet nine or uranus it looks better well, which one of these because these are both custom um custom colors which we've had to um spawn random objects or get a custom one in as well uh yeah so these are very cool and this is exactly the same as uranus in every single way i could look at like all of the materials are all exactly the same like all of the um, composition here if we go back to the radius the mass the density that all these numbers were exactly the same as the regular uranus in universe sandbox so this uranus here so all of the stats were exactly the same so this is, this is an even better job than my custom Uranus, because my custom Uranus, I think its density and material composition was slightly different. So this is the best, literally the best custom object you can make. Like, it's exactly, or it's it perfectly correct. So, again, a massive thanks to some dumb gamer who sent me this object, because this is awesome. And 
Any, for anyone who may be wondering, is this the same as the cyan-coloured gas giant? It's slightly different. If we put the cyan there, you can see the cyan is a lot more, like a, a lot darker in colour than the Uranus is. So yeah, this guy is slightly different. So yeah, there's the um, custom Uranus. But yeah, every single one of you wanted this object. So I'm gonna have to, um, I have to agree with you on that because this this is really cool. And then that's actually um, one thing we'll do as well. So I thought we'd give this um, object its own episode because I think it deserves it. Like, this is really cool. So if we just um, go ahead and add the Uranus rings on it, just to uh, make it look the part as well. So if we just spam this, now you can see this is what it should look like. So this is the full Uranus now. So if we um, put it on studio mode, look at that. That just looks awesome. Like, that'll probably be, like, our thumbnail for today. Just look how cool the that looks. And if we line it up with... Um, oh, excuse me there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, if you line up of all the planets here, just look how good it looks. Like, if we just line it up there, that's how it should be. So, we've got Jupiter and Saturn in their colours, and you've got this really bright blue coloured Uranus. It just looks amazingly awesome. And now, if I um, actually just go ahead and Google Uranus on Google as well. So, if we just, um, yeah, search that up. And then we just um, go on images here, just to get an example. So, this Uranus is pretty much spot on with the real thing. So, if I just um, go on um, display capture here. Wait, is that... I don't know if you can see this right now. If I just do this. Okay, so you guys can see my recording right now. So if I just go on Internet Explorer here, for example, you can see, like, this is a perfect, like, representation. Like, because this is a real image of that Voyager took. This is a, le like, legit perfect example. Like, I think you can see. Can you see Sandbox right now? Uh, yes, you can. So, yeah, this is a perfect example of what Uranus should actually look like. So if we just um, go out of this again. Um, yeah, so if we just, um, yeah, get the customer in and let me just quickly fix the recording thing again. So just do that again, so then, now you can see Sandbox again. So if we, um, go to Uranus again, not Neptune, so, um, oh, so if we go over here, so if we just go to Uranus now, and if we compare it to the proper, like, the actual Uranus, just look how, like, this is so incorrect, like, e even compared to, like, my old custom Uranus, because even the old custom Uranus looked better than that one did, because... Yeah, I remember when we had a vote between these, I'm pretty sure you guys said this looked better, because this Uranus is too similar to Neptune. Like, oh, God, no, no, don't delete, no, keep, keep. I don't know what I was doing there. Yes, yeah, so if we um, compare it to a Neptune, for an example, it's too similar to Neptune, the, the normal Uranus. So, yeah, I've always disliked this object. It just doesn't fit the part of Uranus. It just looks, compared to Neptune, it's too similar. So then we had this Uranus for a while, but when some dumb gamer made this... This just looks really, really cool. Like, compared to Neptune, now you can actually tell the difference a lot easier between Uranus and Neptune. That's how it should be. Like, in loads of other, like, um, space simulator games and just, like, pictures of Uranus, it always comes up in a blue like this. Not like this, um, this blue the game comes in. So I think, um, to the Universe Samox team, you're probably not watching, but make, make this, make this the custom, like, make this is the actual Uranus, like, the Uranus I want to spawn in from this menu, it should be this colour. Like, th this is how it should be. Like, because this is perfect. Like, and don't, and don't give me any credit for making this. This was all made by um, some dumb gamer who made this. So, yeah, many, many thanks to them again because this this is awesome. But, yeah, there we go. So, it is now in my custom solar system right there. So, yeah, just look at that. It just looks amazingly cool. Like, just it just looks perfect. Like, that is so cool. Like, and if you guys want to download this custom Uranus, it should be in the comments of one of the most recent videos. It may have been in last episodes, but I don't know for sure. So you may have to do a little um, looking around for it. But yeah, the comment is there because I definitely haven't deleted it. And it's definitely not in my spam folder because I um, verified them all. And all those, um, all of the comments with links in them are all in the normal comments. Or they should be. So yeah, there's that. So yeah, that pretty much does it for today's episode, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed this like little analysis of the custom Uranus compared to all of the other Uranuses in the game. That we have used and I'm, I'm not even going to mention the old green uranus we had because that just doesn't that doesn't even suit the role of uranus to be honest but yeah please can you help me with series though because i really don't know like does anyone know it's albedo because it, it definitely isn't zero 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 like just it's not correct so yeah please can someone um give me a hand with um series is albedo because i really don't know like i'm pretty intelligent with the space and astronomy and all the objects but i do not know this what this number is does anyone know the number of, like, albedo? Anyone know that number? Because I do not know what it is at all. So I've just left it on 0 0.01 for the time being. Because it shouldn't be 0, 0.00. So, 
yeah, I'll put it on that for now. But yeah, please can you help me out with that? But yeah, that um pretty much does it for today's video, guys. So hopefully you all enjoyed this um different sort of video, so we don't really do much just looking at objects. But yeah, hopefully you um enjoyed it nonetheless. And yeah, if you've got any um ideas for um what if videos so like what if scenarios so what if the sun was this or what if the planets did this or that just um yeah let me know because i've got um i'm actually planning to do the trillion luminosity star soon um in the or, or in the distance of alpha centauri so yeah expect that soon because that should be pretty cool um yeah if you've got any more what if ideas then um leave them on today's video and i'll copy them into my wordpad file which we can which i can then look back on um, without having to go through comments, because it's a lot easier for me having them all on WordPad than looking through all different videos, and then they're all getting jumbled up with other comments and stuff, so it's just a lot easier. So, yeah, if you've got any what-if ideas, comment them on tonight's or today's video, and, yeah, I will copy them onto a WordPad um, file so I can have them all, um, all um, noted down in the same place. So, yeah, um, yeah. so if you've got any ideas, just let, let me know down below. And also, if you haven't already, consider subscribing. Hopefully you won't regret it. And, yeah, that's pretty much everything I need to say, guys. So... Yeah, make sure you guys all have a great day. Let me know what you think is better, the custom Uranus or the custom Planet 9 out there. So which one of these do you think is looks cooler? And yeah, that is everything. So yeah, like I said, have a great day. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.